growing concern about KCPNL's plan to build a new substation near 31st and Troost. Marissa Cleaver explains why some neighbors say that proposal could put children at risk. KCPL hopes to build their substation in this lot at 30th and Forest. That's alarming to those who live nearby. I do believe that there is a health risk. I believe in the same way that you tell a pregnant woman not to stand in front of the microwave. Jody Matthews attends St. Mary of Egypt Orthodox Church a block from the proposed site. She and Mother Nicole, also with the church, are concerned about the kids at Operation Breakthrough. The daycare is across the street from the site. They point to possible links of childhood cancer from exposure to electromagnetic fields. It's like, wait a second, they're putting it right next to a daycare where 500 poor, underserved, underprivileged children are, and it's just craziness. KCPL says the substation is is needed because of an increase in power demands. Spokesman Chuck Casley says the community advisory committee helped choose the location. The company considered health risk. You're exposed to more of that simply by drying your hair in the morning or sitting in a heated car seat or sitting at a computer actually gives you more of exposure to electric magnetic fields than if you were standing anywhere around the daycare center. Matthews and Mother Nicole say there are no conclusive studies discounting the danger. The question the question is, why take the risk? The head of Operation Breakthrough says they formed a special board committee to look into the issue. They are consulting with doctors to determine if there are any health or safety concerns in regard to the substation. In Kansas City, Marissa Cleaver, NBC Action News.